Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Dude, don't first. start being weird. I'm just not gonna talk. So today I'm gonna do a video with my sister, Janet. I'm gonna be doing her makeup while I'm blindfolded. We have about 10 questions that we're gonna answer. So for foundation, I'm gonna be using um, the Milani foundation. I'm gonna use some concealer by Maybelline, my airspun powder, cover effects, highlight drops, and then some champagne pop highlight by Becca Cosmetics. Then I'm gonna put lashes on. <laughs> so, and then some lip gloss. I'm gonna try to do some contouring with this um, Tardius Pro Glow Palette. It's really old, but we're gonna try to use it. So, I don't know. So yeah, I'm gonna put, this is a headband, <clears throat> but it's a blindfold today. Also, you're gonna pass me, you're gonna pass me the items. My goal is to make it look good. I'm not trying to be funny, I'm trying to be serious. Damn, I'm kind of scared. Oh, I'm really red, I'm nervous. Aww. She nervous, wolves. Damn. Do I have a fat head? How does that look? Um, does my hair look dusty? No. Okay, whatever. Yeah, whatever. I mean, you're blind, you can't. I mean, I feel like you're just gonna have to. <laughs> okay, the first question says, do you guys get along? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. You should be scared. Don't I'm you? not. I mean, I'm a little scared, but whatever. We're all gonna die anyway. Okay. Do you guys get along? I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> Great question, anonymous person. Um, I'm gonna say we definitely. I mean, we obviously get along because we're sisters. <laughs> <laughs> um. But should I move my face or not? Like help you no. out? Okay. This my is my job. Okay. Yes, we get along, but I think we definitely can't be. To <laughs> hey. <laughs> what? I, I don't think we can be together for too long, just because she's so what awesome. Cause she. <laughs> No, I don't know how to, I mean like, I don't know what I'm gonna say. I don't know, honestly, I don't know what the hell I'm touching. I don't, it doesn't make sense. I'm with her for too long, I just, I can't, I can't be with her anymore because she's, I don't know, we're just too opposite. Um, do we get along? Hmm, good question. Get along. <laughs> we do get along. I think we're like pretty opposite, like, we're pretty opposite and um, I mean, I don't know. She um, does, she pisses me off, but, but you that's every sister. Too. Yeah. We actually have fought. We before. have fought, yeah. And I won. <laughs> and I cried. And I won. I think that's enough for your foundation. <laughs> don't laugh. Are you for real trying? Or are you just trying? I to promise play? to God, Janet, I'm trying. I really, like, I promise to God. I put it on God, I'm trying. Next question. Um, and pass me the concealer and the sponge. Are you guys more than sisters? Do you consider yourself besties? Aww, Great question, anonymous person. Well, we don't, we're not like, oh my god, we're besties, and we're not like calling each other besties and stuff. But I feel like she is the person I tell the most to, like, out of like my friends and stuff. She does like know the most, and she is the person that I talk to like the most about things that I don't feel comfortable telling my, my actual friends. I mean, I do tell my friends a lot of stuff too, but I feel like your sister is just somebody that like you know that you can trust, they're not gonna. Hopefully they don't talk about you behind your back. I think what you're trying to say is that we are each other's best friend. We just don't call each other like, yeah. So, I mean, so I guess, yeah, I would say she's my best friend. You're like, uh -uh. Oh, that's, that's, my sister that's too, my like, what's the word? Like mushy, is that the word? Too affectionate? Yeah, it's like, I don't like showing feelings. She does not like showing feelings. I don't. And I and that's like with my boyfriend. That's with my uh, my friends. That's with everybody. I don't like showing feelings. That stuff is really weird to me. It's like ugh, feelings. Yeah, she's my best friend. Ew. Aww. I'm your best friend. Next question. This one says something that you do that irritates each other. I was ready for this question. Where's the powder? Uh, I honestly don't have an answer. Like I don't. Cause I'm not irritating. You first of all, you are a little girl. Am I in the camera still? 
I will when we open mine. Yeah. <laughs> Give me the big brush. Okay. <laughs> oh well. Um, okay. Number one. So she likes to come into my room a lot. Like a lot. And she likes to take naps in there, which is fine. Like I like when she sleeps with me because it makes me feel more comfortable. Hold this. I'm and, trying okay. to find the middle of your face. I know it's just your nose, little girl. I know. When she comes in and she takes a nap, I will wake up because she snores so loud. So loud. The reason I like her to sleep with me is because I like, I get kind of anxious sometimes. If she's snoring, like I feel, I feel more anxious. Like I really can, like I cannot stand when you snore. I really can't <laughs> because you don't even snore pretty. Snores are not cute. Like they're like man snores. I don't know how to explain them. They're really loud. I'm not even how? like, they're. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you wake me up. When I say I'm a heavy sleeper, I like, I don't wake up for anything. Mm -hmm. The second thing that really irritates me is when you borrow my clothes, but you never ask or let me know. Like you try to be sneaky with it. And like, I noticed. Okay, so like we work at Burlington together, like part-time. Couldn't find my work <laughs> pants. Why? <laughs> like, how am I not gonna notice you're wearing my work pants? And then, <laughs> Jet, you better wipe that off because that was not me. Oh. Um, when she gets mad because I want to go somewhere and she's like, you didn't give me enough time to get ready. Bro. And I'm like, I want to spend time as a family and I want to go out and you're literally needing like two hour notice. So like that really annoys Yeah, me. because always tell me like five minutes before they leave. Uh, just because she's hard headed. That's annoying. Um, when she asks too many questions, like sometimes you ask too many questions. So I am. So I'm, I'm really nosy. I can't. I'm like, really nosy. I, I want to know everything all the time. Uh, she has so many double standards. Like what? Excuse me, when I'm in your car and you have your music blasting, when she puts her music so loud. I really, brrr, brrr, really brrr. Like I turn it down and I'm like, turn it. Nah, this is my car. I can do whatever I want. And then in my car, when I have my music, she thinks she can turn it down. And I'm like, no, this is my car. Because she puts the dustiest music ever. It's some sad music. It's all kind of music. No, it's, it's not. It's all kind of music. If you put um, reggaeton, I'll leave it on. Anyway. But you always have on some dusty old music. I couldn't think of anything. The only thing that I can think of is that like sometimes when you say a word in Spanish, you say it like you don't know how to speak Spanish. Like, oh, yeah. You like do. she'll say churros. Can I get some churros? Let's go get some tacos. <laughs> I'm like, dude. Okay. I'm like, dude. Yeah. She... You mean tacos. You yeah. mean churros. You mean torta. I'm like, she's like, give me some, ma. Can you make me a torta? <laughs> I'm like, dude, it's a torta. Come on. Okay, that, that gets on my nerves. That does. I know that does get on your nerves, but like, I just hate switching accents. Like if I'm gonna say, but that's Mom, word. I'm so hungry. I want tacos. Like that sounds weirder to me than just saying. No, oh, because you know, because tacos is a word in Spanish. How are you gonna say I know, tacos? But like, you I'm don't have to like speak I'm already Spanish. in the English tone. I'm just gonna keep <laughs> using it. I don't know. That's just what I do. Not because I don't like to speak Spanish. It's just I know, but it, just, it gets on my nerves because it's not hard to switch from English to Spanish. I know, but I'm just that lazy. I guess I don't know. Mm -mm -mm. Next is lashes. Give me the glue and give me the lash. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> biggest mistake of your life. I do know the biggest mistake of my life. You know what I'm talking about, probably. Do you? I don't know. Oh yeah, <laughs> that was one. the biggest mistake of my life. Yeah. So I would say the biggest mistake of my life after that one was probably sometimes I think about if it was a mistake for me to stop going to school because I had just broken up with somebody. Also, I was kind of confused if I wanted to still major in my major at the time, and I was just not motivated because I was just like really sad and stuff. I was in my room, so sometimes. I think about if I made the right decision by, I hate saying dropping out, cause that sounds so bad. But I guess I did like drop out and sometimes I do think about that. And I would say that's that's a big mistake. Like I don't wanna say- Something you would do differently. Yeah, I don't wanna call it a mistake, but I would question myself about that a lot. A biggest mistake. Put this back in the tube. I really can't think of anything. I just, I really, I really cannot think of anything. 
All right, next question. Um, next caller. Next caller. Uh, Y'all should get matching tats. Technically, we kind of have matching tats already. They're not matching, but they're not like the same exact thing. But like they match because they go together. Yeah, Period. I have the sun, and I got the moon. And she got the moon. It was her idea. I got it off Pinterest. So hold on, everybody, pause because we're about to do the lashes. You can't talk, and I can't talk. I need to be concentrated. Eyes open or closed? Closed, little girl. Wait, am I? Hey. This is gonna be kind of hard. Ooh, wee. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I think I did that. I think I did that. Don't, are you going to glue my eyes shut? Open like your eye. Give me the other lash. <laughs> okay. That's good. Favorite memory together. A memory that I think we always talk about and that always comes up is <laughs> when we were little. We're never gonna forget this. We're never gonna forget never. this. Like we're, this was... So we were just like messing around and then I don't know why, but literally we were just kind of like... Hey, Ow! Good, <laughs> <laughs> tell me! So I hit her really hard in the back and then... Ow! And then she hit me really hard on the back. And I don't know if we did it more than once or twice, but the point is we Yeah, hit you know when, when it's like a little competition between you and your like brother and sister and it's like who can hit each other harder? Like it was we started off just hitting each other on the back really soft, like mm, mm. And then we just went harder and harder until remember the next day or the next couple of days we got McDonald's and burger. It was like a, I think it was a cheeseburger and it was the most blandest like I could not take like I didn't I didn't eat it. Yeah. The I one, never reject a burger. I don't know when it started. But I remember that after we had done that, like the next day, I would try to eat stuff and it just wouldn't taste good. We were not and eating. And my mom was kinda like trying to feed us whatever to try to get us to eat because we weren't eating. Right. So she goes to McDonald's, she gets us our little meal or whatever. I got a quarter pounder and I remember I bit it and it tasted like nothing. Like it nothing. did not taste good. It tasted like I was eating air. Yeah. I said, mm-mm. 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 Mm -mm. mm -mm. That's how you know something was wrong. If because... we were not eating, if I was not eating, something's wrong. Mm -hmm. That it's because we were hitting each other because what's the coincidence that we both can't taste anything. Mm -hmm. We probably like knocked a, a nerve mm -hmm. out or something like <laughs> led to like <laughs> our mouth or who knows, but I really think that we like knocked out our taste buds because we couldn't taste anything. I don't even know how long it lasted. I don't remember okay. that. I don't remember that long ago whole coronavirus situation they're saying that one of the symptoms is the loss of um taste or smell and it's kind of funny because that's that's what we experienced since but <gasps> dang that was just yours okay my favorite memory um i'll say one of like my favorite memories is remember we had like that pool that we would sit in the front mm. right here and we would like, we would inflate only the bottom. Mm -hmm. Like we wouldn't even inflate the whole thing cause it was probably mm -hmm. pop or something, I don't know. And we would just chill on there. We would do like little belly slides. Yeah. And that felt, that would feel like so long. Mm -hmm. Like it was a lot, like now that I think about it, that thing is small. Yeah. At the time we were so small and it felt like, I don't know, but now it's like, <laughs> we a water park. I'll, I'll probably turn around and it's like, oh dang, <laughs> it's the wall already. But yeah, that was, that was fun. Also, like when when um, grandma and dad and like we all lived here, and I think I know what you're gonna say. My dad would like hella buy us food. There was like a time where um, my dad had bought us. Um, he had bought us a little bit of KFC, a little bit of McDonald's, little Hot little bit chips. of chips, a little bit of everything. He so give me a little chicken. Yeah. Chippy chip. Dad like to. He always took us to McDonald's all the yeah, time. Yeah, all the time. Yeah. Not saying that my mom doesn't. Yeah. Shout out to you, mom. Yeah. Shout out to mom. <laughs> the most important one. Yes. But when we lived but with yeah, our dad, he. That's what it was. Yeah. Next caller. Something you. Where's my highlight oh, brush? Something you always wanted to tell each other, but you haven't. Nothing, because everything I want to tell her, I tell her. <laughs> um, I remember there was a time when. Oh yeah. And nobody i don't think i have told anybody but my sister and she was laughing at me i had told her something really serious and she was laughing at me <laughs> and i was crying too like wow dude i'm funny. not telling you anything ever again same that's my same answer there's nothing that i when she makes me mad she knows it yeah like i feel like you like again with like friends and sisters like sometimes 
with your friends it's kind of like you hold back because it's like oh i don't know if that's gonna be too mean but with your sister it's like i don't care dude like you're being annoying you're talking too much shut up yeah get out my room yeah next next caller the show next oh. did you guys get jealous of each other's gifts growing up i'm saying no you should not be getting jealous of your siblings or your friends like that's not you don't do that plus i don't really think that we even got like crazy gifts like that to we be didn't. getting jealous we have never really been like big celebrators of holidays i guess yeah uh, which i'm not mad or upset about it's yeah. just never it's been just, a thing. it's just a fact like, yeah it's just a fact we don't feel no kind of way about it it's just like it's just what it is how yeah. we grew up i guess but i do remember a long time ago you did have this birthday party but i remember like she was opening her gifts and i was like right there next to her and like every time she would grab something i literally was like oh is this when i was like little and i had like a pink shirt on or something yeah i remember being Aww. jealous like oh <laughs> i want that set of 24 pack markers i'm dead other than that no I feel like we were kind of younger though, so kids don't know how to control their emotions. Yeah, and honestly, I think that was like your only birthday party ever. I feel like I had more birthday parties. Yeah, I never really had birthday parties for real. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let, let me... So this is lip gloss, so you can't be moving your mouth. So this is the last step, and then I'm gonna take my blindfold off. <laughs> oh, no. I'm about to touch your lips, ew. Ew. Okay, go like this. Do you like it? I love it. Mm. All right, I'm about to reveal my masterpiece. Ooh. Dang, it's bright. It actually doesn't look that bad. I told you I was gonna do good. Look, look down. This lash would have been on your eye on point. Look at that. Oh my God, I'm so mad. Let me see. Look, my placement is on point with my lashes. Look down. <laughs> Highlight isn't bad. You were talking and I think you got distracted. Here. Oh, dang. I you forgot did. to come back. No, it's not that bad. Mm -mm. You well, like the lashes? That... Yeah, yeah, I do like the lashes. They look cute. Let me see. Look back. Let me scoot back. Yeah. Oh, now I look a little bad because my lashes got squished. That was our sister video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Liked it a little bit. If you did, give us a like. Subscribe to my channel because during this quarantine, I'm going to be doing a lot more videos because I've been slacking. I always say that, but this video was kind of awkward because I haven't filmed a video in forever. And I'm just like awkward in general. Like I'm just an awkward person. That was it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.